olive oil right. with some onion in there. And then I've got some broccoli here, just some broccoli florets. You can use the stock too though if you have it. Ingredient number two. Ingredient number two. So I like to just let those saute a little bit, add some Get salt and up. pepper yep. in there. Got you covered. Put that in there for me. And then you put in a box of chicken broth or vegetable broth. Put the whole thing in there. Thank you for using Rachel Ray chicken stock. You know what? It's my favorite. Good one, I like it. All right, so 10 okay, minutes so later, it simmers. Onions, saute mm -hmm. out, uh, sweat out your, your broccoli a little bit, mm -hmm. add your stock. Yep, oh, I should have put the stock in that one. Doesn't matter, whatever. Sweated, but... Then it looks like this, dude. Okay, so I've got one here that's been going for about 10 minutes. Let's okay. take this over to hey, the blender. Honey? Is it too hot? Uh, it's Are you not okay? too hot, I'm all right. Okay. okay, so we're gonna put this in the blender. Do we have a ladle? Wanna... Sure. Um, you know, you want to do this in batches so that it doesn't like spew all over the place. Or if you have one of those immersion blenders, you can put I that in the pot. I love those things. They're love so those. cheap and cheerful. Yeah. I love them. They're great. And then I'll just pour in the broth and gotcha. we'll give it a good blend. And that's it. So super easy, super quick. Well, we didn't get to the cheese yet. Though. Well, not yet. That's the good part. I know. I'm like, no, that ain't it because I was <laughs> promised cheese. Dang it. <laughs> It goes back, back into, the, into pot. the pot. I've got one simmering over here, so it's nice and creamy and rich. And then we're gonna pour in our cheese. And this is just some grated cheddar cheese, yum. Mm -hmm. And so without having any cream in this, you're still gonna get that rich, hearty soup feeling. Right, and it's, and it's not like 10,000 calories a bowl, right, right? Right, exactly. And then ladle it out. I've got some more cheese to put on top. Yeah. Yep. It's not like eat a bowl of this and you can't zip your jeans tomorrow. No, no, not at all. And you know, this recipe, play around, you can add if you have a jalapeno in the Ooh, cover, that's a good know, idea, put buddy. Put that in there. You can put a clove of garlic. So oh, this is screaming hot. I'm going to put it down. Yeah, room. let it cool off a bit. So you let it cool off a little bit, throw a little more cheese on top, have it with a sandwich.